Hello and welcome to Storytime for Kids. Today we're going to read Little Kids First Big Book of Reptiles and Amphibians by Katherine D. Hughes from National Geographic Kids. If you have never heard of these books, you're missing out. They're amazing. They're really, really good for kids and for adults. I'm learning so much. <laughs> and if it, this is the first uh, video you're watching, you just want to know I created a playlist with this exact name. Okay, so you can look up for chapter one and chapter two. Today we're going to do chapter three. So here we go. Chapter three, and their shells. In this chapter, you will read about turtles and tortoises and find out how they are the same and different. What are turtles? Turtles are reptiles with shells. Some turtles spend most of their time in water. They are aquatic turtles. Other turtles spend most of their time on land. They are terrestrial turtles and are often called tortoises. Aquatic turtles tend to have flatter and lighter shells than those of terrestrial turtles. Aquatic turtles have webbed feet. The shape of their shells and their webbed feet make swimming easier. Tortoises and other terrestrial turtles have rounded shells. Their feet have short claws and are not webbed. Sea turtles rarely leave the ocean. Their feet are shaped like paddles, which they use to swim. This is a green sea turtle, and these are the paddles. A turtle cannot crawl out of its shell. The shell is a part of its body. The top part of a turtle's shell is called the carapace, and the bottom is called the plastron. This is an eastern spiny soft shell turtle. Hawksville sea turtle. Sea turtles nest on beaches. Six other sea turtles swim the world's oceans. The loggerhead, leatherback, cambridle, green, olive brittle, and flat back. Hawksville sea turtles can be found in ocean waters around the world. Like other sea turtles, male hawksbills never come ashore. Female sea turtles only come ashore to make nests and lay eggs. First, the female hawksbill digs a hole in the sand with her back flippers. Then she lays her eggs in a hole and covers them all with sand. She returns to the ocean and swims away. Sixty days later, the eggs hatch. The baby turtles dig their way out of the nest. Then they scurry into the sea. Facts Home Shallow coastal waters and reefs in tropical Pacific, Atlantic, and Indian oceans. Food Mostly sea sponges. Babies. Wow. A hundred to hundred and forty eggs at a time. And this is how big they are compared to a child. The Hawksville sea turtle gets its name from the shape of its beak, which looks like a hawk's beak. Hmm, makes sense, right? Can you memorize and then name the seven species of sea turtles? Alligator snapping turtle. This turtle's tongue plays trick on prey. Alligator snapping turtles rarely leave the water. Females come ashore only to lay eggs. An alligator snapping turtle can stay underwater for up to 50 minutes before it must come to the surface to breathe. Its dark shell blends in with the mud at the bottom of a river. 
It lies there perfectly still, with its mouth open and its bright pink tongue wiggling. The wiggling tongue fools fish into thinking it is a tasty worm. As a fish moves in to grab the worm, the alligator snapping turtle snaps its jaws shut. Now the fish is a turtle's dinner. Facts. Home. Rivers, lakes, and swamps in the southeastern U.S. Food. Fish and other small animals. Aquatic plants. Babies. 8 to 52 eggs at a time. And this is their size. They can get really, really big. Turtles do not have teeth. Instead, they have beaks that they use to cut and slice their food. Can you wiggle your tongue like a snapping turtle? Painted turtle. This turtle's shell looks like it was decorated with yellow and red paint. When they are cold, painted turtles crawl out of the water and onto a log or rock to sun themselves. Painted turtles have many predators. Adult turtles must watch out for alligators, raccoons, and birds of prey, such as hawks, owls, and eagles. Little baby turtles, which are on their own from the time they hatch, can also be gobbled up by a fish, frogs, and large wadding birds, such as herons and egrets. Facts Home Shallow, slow-moving water in most of North America. Food. Plants, fish, insects, and crayfish. Babies. 4 to 15 eggs at a time. Size. They don't grow too much. All turtles lay eggs. Do you prefer to finger paint or paint with a brush? And why? I think I like a brush better. But when I was a kid, I liked to paint with my fingers. <laughs> Just so you know, we have one of these. She's probably this big. She's teeny tiny. Indian narrow-headed soft-shell turtle. This turtle does not have a hard shell. Facts. Home. Deep water in freshwater rivers in southern Asia. Food. Mainly fish, crabs, shrimp, frogs, and other small animals. Sometimes plants. Babies. 60 to 190 eggs at a time. Wow, and they can grow very big too. The carapace of a soft-shell turtle is not covered by hard plates like most turtles' shells. It is covered by leathery skin instead. Indian narrow-headed soft-shell turtles spend most of their time buried in sand at the bottom of rivers. They stay hidden and wait for prey to pass nearby. This turtle has a very long neck. When a tasty fish swims by, the turtle quickly stretches out its neck to catch dinner with its mouth. This turtle breathes by stretching its neck so that just the tip of its nose pops up above the water surface. Female narrow-headed soft turtles only come ashore to lay eggs. Can you think of an animal with a name that starts with the letter G that also has a very long neck? I'm pretty sure you know which one we're talking about. <laughs> mata Mata this turtle could be mistaken for a pile of leaves. Bumps, lumps, and spikes cover the Matamata's dark yellowish-brown carapace. Its head is shaped like a triangle and looks like a dead leaf. The Matamata's looks help it hide from its prey. A Matamata sucks its prey into its mouth like a vacuum cleaner. This turtle swallows food whole. Whoop! This is the carapace. This reptile has a lot of nicknames, including needle nose and leaf head. Facts. Home. 
muddy bottoms of slow-moving streams, marshes, and swamps of northern South America and Trinidad and Tobago. Food. Mostly fish, also insects, shellfish, and other small animals. Babies. 12 to 28 eggs at a time. Size. Oh, they're very tiny. The Matamata belongs to a group of turtles called side-necked turtles. How would you describe what this turtle looks like to someone who has never seen it? I love these turtles. They're so cute. <laughs> Eastern box turtle. Box turtles can close up tight like a box. Most male eastern box turtles have red eyes, while most females have yellow eyes. What color are your eyes? Look, this is how they close up tight. If a raccoon, fox, or other predator starts to attack it, a box turtle pulls in its head, legs, and tail. Then it snaps shut its shell. This reptile's tough shell is very hard to any attacker to open. Most predators give up, so the turtle inside almost always survives. Box turtles have only slightly webbed feet. They rarely swim, but they do soak in puddles. Most of their time is spent on land. Facts Home Woodlands, grasslands, and marshy areas, often near ponds or streams in the eastern U.S. Food. Earthworms, slugs, insects, berries, flowers, and more. Babies. 1 to 11 eggs at a time. Size. Oh, they are big. Box turtles often cool off in shady puddles. A box turtle can live a hundred years. Wow, that is amazing. Herman's tortoise. This tortoise hibernates under a pile of leaves during the winter. When a Herman's tortoise crawls out of its hibernating spot in the early spring, it looks for a mate. A couple of months later, the female tortoise digs a hole and lays her eggs. She covers them by refilling the hole with dirt. The eggs usually hatch in September, and the baby tortoises dig their way out of the nest. For the first five years, the young tortoises do not go far from their nest. It can take years for their shell to harden completely so they need to be able to scoot into their den to escape predators. There is a spike on the end of its tail. Spike. Hernan's tortoises find a shady shelter when the sun gets too hot. Facts. Home. Forests, dry meadows, rocky hills, and farmland in southern Europe. Food. Mostly dandelions, clovers, and other plants. Babies. Two to twelve eggs at a time. They also grow quite big. These tortoises usually hatch in September. In what month were you born? I was born in December. Galapagos giant tortoise. These are the world's largest tortoise. These huge tortoises nap about 16 hours each day. You see, that's why it's so important to take a nap. <laughs> Dome-shaped tortoise. Not all Galapagos tortoises look alike. Tortoises on some islands have shells shaped like a saddle with a notch or cut out at the front. These tortoises also have long necks and legs. They are called saddlebacks. A saddleback can raise its head and stretch its legs high enough to eat plants growing up off the ground. 
tortoises on other islands have shorter necks and legs. They are called dome-shaped tortoises. Their shells don't have a notch, so the tortoises cannot lift their head as high as the saddleback tortoises can. They graze on plants like grasses that grow close to the ground. Facts. Home. Grassy, dry lowlands and wetter highlands on the Galapagos Islands, off the shore of Ecuador in South America. Food. Plants such as cactus, grass, flowers, and fruits. Babies. Two to 16 eggs at a time. And they're huge. Look. Compared to a child, this is a saddleback tortoise. Galápago is a Spanish word for tortoise. Here are a few of the more than 300 species of turtles and tortoises found around the world. Black knobbed map turtle. Radiated tortoise. Leopard tortoise. Indian star tortoise. Wow, look at this shell. It's so amazing. Peak nose turtle. <laughs> you see a nose? Ornate wood turtle. Ooh, this is chapter four, which means we're done for the today and I will see you back for chapter four. I hope you like this this chapter and you learn something about turtles. I love turtles. Uh, we have three. Thank you very much for listening. Um, I hope you learned a lot today, just like I did, and I will see you soon. Bye!